change. And I have to ask you about the Green Party. They could win big in the election here in Germany in September. The next German chancellor could be a 40-year-old Green Party co-leader. And she will have a lot in common in terms of policy with the 78-year-old moderate Joe Biden. That's right. And I mean, I think it's remarkable to see what's happening over here in Germany. I mean, for the first time in 16 years, uh, the name on the ballot is not going to be Angela Merkel again. I mean, there's exactly 150 days to go until German Election Day. And you mentioned the polls right now. The Greens are in the lead. I think there's still a lot of runway uh, for the CDU to continue to come back. But at the same time, you're absolutely right. Germany is facing some of the same issues to determine how to bring back the economy, how to get ready for climate change. And I think what the Green Party has laid out so far is that they also want to spend big, not just on the economy, but also on green technology and green jobs. And I think that's one path forward uh, for both Joe Biden, as he laid out yesterday, but also for Annalena Baerbock and the Green Party. Mm. Yeah, I think we can say tonight that Joe Biden would have no problems with having a green government here in Germany. Julius von der Laar here in Berlin and Carolina Chamoy, our correspondent in Texas tonight to both of you. Thank you.